nothing in the last few days, but very soon the wait will be over. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a thrilling finale. It's Real Madrid against Atletico Madrid. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. No doubt both managers will have set out their game plans and made sure every player knows exactly what their roles are. What a game we have in store for us. Griezmann tasked with taking the corner. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Saul giving it a try. And simple for the keeper. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Kepa stands between the posts. Ferlon Mendy plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And this is how Atletico will line up. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Marcos Llorente starts alongside Koke. In... And still danger here. A world-class talent. That would be a good description for Vinicius Junior. What might we see from him today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease. And he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Going well. And the defensive intervention there. Surely... Real Madrid make the opening statement in the final and it could be massively important well I have to say this is a really good goal just look how well balanced he is he knows he's going to be under pressure but he shows great composure to hit the target well, I love the celebration, but Ancelotti's got to get his players refocused now. Are back underway, and 1 0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Morata is up there. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next in the drama? Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So the ball is rolling again at one all. David Alaba. And credit due, a good intervention. Well, shielding the ball admirably. It's an excellent looking attack, courtesy of Griezmann here. That's not a bad ball. Just the clearance that was needed. Might be a chance here. Must finish. And a goal to put them in front. Real drama here. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. That could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. Back at action then. Let's see if Atletico, having conceded, can wipe out that last goal. Hermoso. Javi Galan. It's a good-looking Atletico move in the making. 
Morata. Can he play it in? There will be one minute added on at the end. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. to the second half then and it's going to be fascinating to see whether or not Atletico can turn this game on its head and quick thinking defensively not a foul but the advantage with Real Madrid Tony Kroos now with Bellingham And he read it well, intercepting it. Griezmann. Morata. Morata! And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance, and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Well, Simeone has to get his team playing again. This isn't going to plan, that's for sure. Well, the action underway once more. And no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Koke. Molina. Koke with it. Threaded through by Koke. Can they put it away? And up for grabs off the keeper. And the flag has gone up just when he looked ready to pounce, perhaps. Well, he was just too static in the end, which is a shame because that was a dangerous situation. Well, I can't believe Atleti are losing here. They've created so many good opportunities. But unless they score soon, they're going to start to get frustrated. A well, chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Savage. The delivery. It could be... Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. It is an Atletico substitution. Well, did his job defensively. Breaking at pace. And it's a quality pass. Can he do it? And attacking with real pace and devilment. All that was missing was a goal. Well, you're absolutely right. That's how to counter-attack. It really was a great move. And Atletico have the ball again. Ten minutes to go. Atletico Madrid know they're not going to get too many more chances. Time is a factor. This could be the equaliser. What a commitment to defending. 
Well, still playing here, Real Madrid want to make this a victory. Stuart, interested in your thoughts on their overall performance. Well, what a finale we have here. Both sides have looked good going forward, but poor defensively. But I do think they have been the better side for much of this game. They just need to defend their box with determination in these last few minutes. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. And there it is, the final whistle. Cup success is theirs, and they've done it on merit. Look at these scenes. Well, on the evidence of the game as well, they deserve it. They were excellent throughout. What a good performance that was.